Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name's Carl and you're joining me on a new series, Next Gen Energy. And to kick it off, we're starting with an unboxing. Roll the credits. So we've been sent some goodies um, from My Energy. So we've been sent the Zappy Charger. We've also been sent the Eddie and the Harvey. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go through each one of these, have an unboxing, see what it's all about. Okay, so I'll be honest with you. Yeah, it's open. I got into trouble for this. Um, I jumped the gun, um, and the camera crew are a bit, a bit mad because I tried to get a sneaky look beforehand, um, but they did stop me um, before I went all the way in. So happy days with that. So basically, what we're going to do now is look at the next product. So. Again, from my energy, so this is um, the full package, basically. The only thing that we haven't got is a little home hub, which you can get, and we'll talk about in it in um, the later videos down the line. But basically, all this kit will be compatible with each other, and it'll allow you to have um, a lot of flexibility in your system and, and just basically um, utilise some cool kit. So, let's have a proper look. So, like I said, we've, we've looked at the Harvey already. This one's the Eddie. So, we'll open it up. Like I say, packaging, fantastic. There's nothing gonna get damaged in this. They've, they've really thought about this and packaged it well, um, which is good because like I say, if you're paying money out for, for this kind of equipment and you want it to arrive in one piece, you want it to be um, you want it to be good quality and just from how it's put together already and I haven't even seen the device, um, yeah, good stuff so far. So, as with anything, um, you have um, an operation installation manual. Um, it's a fair manual, that. So, like I say, that's going to be perfect because with this kind of device, um, there's going to be a lot of different things, um, a lot of different ways, basically, you can install it. So, we'll have a look at that. And like I say, all these products, um, we will be doing a more in-depth review of um, in, the, in the upcoming videos. Uh, but for now, we're just going to have a quick look, see what it is, um, and, yeah, just have a look inside. So, we've got the installation um, book there. We've also got a CT clamp which is good. So that sort of ties in with what we've just been discussing, to be honest, with a little Harvey. So we've got a CT clamp there for that. We've got a CT clamp for the Harvey, so we're up to two clamps so far. Um, inside as well, like I say, the packaging. The real thought about this, actually, which is good. Put that in there. And then, <laughs> I'm gonna try and do this without tipping it out, actually. But as you can see, we have the Eddie. So let's get it out properly and have a closer look. There's some weight to this actually. So you can already, you can already, um, yeah, you can already tell it's good quality. It's, it's quite heavy actually. Um, but basically what we have here is the Eddy by My Energy. Um, and as it says there, it's a micro generation energy diverter. So this actual device itself is gonna be able to um, divert energy uh, produced from renewables, uh, renewable source such as solar PV. Um, and what you'll be able to do is divert that energy to be utilizing and, and put in a system such as um, a hot water tank or maybe an electric um, radiator setup or even underfloor heating, something like that. So there's a few different setups that this device can be um, put into. And the thing with it is, is it's like anything uh, moving forward these days is it's gonna be um, adaptable and, and put in place for renewable energies, which is fantastic. So, like I say, build quality so far is absolutely solid. It weighs a fair bit. Um, so yeah, so far it's, it feels like a really good product. Um, you've got the few points here. So to me, that just looks like the, um, the aerial point there. And then obviously you've got the on off switch there at the bottom. It's labeled at the front as well, on, off and bypass. So we'll have a look at what those are as well when we review this product fully. Um, but yeah, let's have a look at how we're gonna actually get into this actually. So from what I can see, it just seems to be two screws on the front. So I'll pop these off. Um, they are tiny screws to be honest. So maybe when you are installing this, just be mindful of the way you're actually putting the screws. So there's two screws there, and there we have it. Cover straight off, which is good. And there we have it. So we've got all the gubbins inside. As you can see, there's quite a lot going on inside this. Um, but basically, looking at this um, device itself, it's quite nicely laid out, to be honest. Obviously, you've got the main screen there. So once this device is powered up, you'll have all the interface there showing you exactly what it's doing. 
um, and obviously the control buttons there which tie up with the front of the actual um, cover there so inside what do we have so we have um, we have the supply coming in so supply cable coming in like I say this this tends to be um, wired into um, feed basically like a, a, an immersion eater something like that so hot water cylinder um, you would have your feed coming in into there and then obviously you have ct1 and ct2 so these are allowing you to put your ct uh, connections in place and obviously that ct clamp would be going back to the main supply as well so with the harvey itself um transmitting that information as well um, and obviously that ct um, can be clamped around as well in terms of load management and just seeing exactly what's being sent um, export import that kind of stuff I and mean, it's going to be really good in terms of uh, pairing out with a home app as well and seeing exactly where where your energy is going and where it's being utilized basically so you got supply you got ct connections there and you also have here the heater connections so like i've mentioned you can have this set up so you can have this installed and this basically can be wired up to a hot water uh, cylinder with the heating elements in there and what it will do is any excess energy um, provided from renewable sources such as solar pv or something like that um, it can be diverted um, with this device and, and utilize to heat up that water tank um, it's good thing as well to note that this actual device you can have it wired up in your central heating system so basically this can be the main the main source basically um, to take the energy from your renewables that kind of stuff um, and be the main point to heat up that tank and then you can have it where you can put a, um, a relay installed as well and that could be um, the changeover from utilizing this as a main point to heat the tank and having the gas back up there um, just as basically as a backup like I've just said but you would have to install a relay um, configuration for it as well for that to be able to happen but from first impressions really good um, like I say it's heavy uh, it seems well built connections there it looks like it's got a good good amount of room it's got these clamps um, it's well well laid out easy to understand and, and find out exactly where things are in terms of mounting it um, you can see there just on the back it's got the different mounting points so with it being quite a heavy piece of equipment it really does want to be secured to the wall and I, I think that there nice solid back plate there is going to do the job so yeah really good stuff so far so yeah we'll pop this back together and like I said we will be doing a more in-depth uh, review of these products individually and we'll get to a point where we can actually have them powered up and look at some of the more interesting um, and, and, and you know helpful features that they all have but to put it back together once it's obviously it'll be a lot better once it's mounted on the wall just pop the cover on and let's do two screws and the jobs are good okay so yeah I'll bob this one back together and then we'll look at the next one which is the zappy thanks for watching please check out our other videos on the channel and if you've enjoyed this video please hit the like button below also the subscribe button and if you hit the notification bell below you'll be notified when we hit our next content out on the channel thanks for watching take care